This is chapter 2, section 3, solving quadratics, lesson 3, video 3 of the three videos, using zeros to write functions. So the example says write the quadratic function in standard form with zeros 2 and negative uh, 1. The first thing that you need to understand is that that is the two things that x is equal to. So x is equal to 2 or x is equal to negative 1. If you wanted to set these both equal to zero, you would have to work backwards. You will now recognize that you are pretty much doing what we've done in earlier videos, or in uh, videos one and two of the section three, um, in order to get the quadratic that would have started this process. Now, this is the part where the zero product property allowed us to split um, our two factors in order to solve. So we are going to unsplit them and multiply them together instead. Now you need to FOIL. First is x squared, outside is plus x, inside is minus 2x, last is negative 2. Combine like terms and you are done. Please understand that x minus a is a factor. Therefore, if you know what your a's are, you can plug them in in order to very, very quickly go from the question to the multiplied form. But if you don't remember to do that, just set your zeros equal to x and then work your way backwards. Either way, when you are done, you should end up with a quadratic that looks something like this, but with a different a, b, and c. Your u try says to write the quadratic function in standard form with zeros 5 and negative 5. Again, x minus a is a factor, and your a's are both 5 and negative 5. So you will write two of these. And that is the end of the final video.